Hey everybody, what's up? I'm Nicole and I am back. I just wanted to update you a little bit about what I've been doing. I got to sail on the Admiralty Dream for two weeks as my ship, the Baranoff Dream, is getting ready. I wanted to do a little ship tour for you. So the Admiralty Dream is a 143 feet vessel. It can hold 54 passengers and it has 27 staterooms. While I was working on it, there were 24 crew members. We had the galley team, the chefs and the dishwashers. We had stewards, a hotel manager. We had the captain, the engineers, the deckhands, and then the expedition leaders, myself, and the naturalist. So. I think that's everybody let's get started and show you the tour so to begin this is the boat it's a beautiful boat I loved working on it this is really similar to the boat that I'll be working on the Baranoff dream it's just a little bit larger so it has the four levels the bridge deck the upper deck the main deck and the lower deck and the lower deck is where the crew cabins are here is the bridge. So this is Anna and she is one of the chief mates, helps drive the boats. Right through this hallway is the dining room, which they really do an amazing job of setting it up cute every night, different shapes of the napkins. Here are some of the guests enjoying, I believe this is dinner, must be, because they're having wine. Then next is the kitchen. This is, that's Chef Evan, who I really I think he's a phenomenal chef. I loved all of his food. Look at his, I think these are like pork loins or something. Wow, yum. If we go into the kitchen, uh, this is a different time period when Chef Destiny, Chef Evan were in the kitchen. Yum, cooking away. It's a pretty nice kitchen. Here's the dish line. You send the dishes through that little dishwasher and um, washes them. Make, that's like a sous chef making salads and they make desserts. Now for the pantry, we have this little area that stores all of our dried goods, lots of cans, breads, things like that. And then this is another room with uh, like refrigerators. It's almost like a grocery store, the way that they organize their shelves, lots of food. And then there's also freezers that are upstairs. I didn't get that. Uh, next is, this is kind of a crew area, so these are the crew cabins. There's some on this level and then there's some underneath. This is my room. So I lived with three other girls in this tiny room. We call this the Shoilet, the shower toilet combined. There are my three roommates, Madison, Kara, and Kenzie. This is the room, quick tour. So my bed was that one right there. Literally couldn't get up there or get down without hitting your head. Uh, four girls in a tiny spot. Yeah, this is me trying to emphasize how close I am to the ceiling. I'm laying in bed and like pounding my head onto the ceiling. It was a pretty tight squeeze. Uh, also, it was near the engine room, so I wanted to show you. Yep, that's how loud it was every night, which I kind of liked because I like fan noises, white noise. This is the engine room, so as you can see, my room is on the right and there's the engine room on the left. Here's where the crew does their laundry. Just other stuff, ice machine, water. And then if you go out towards the back of the boat, the fantail, we have kind of the loading zone. This is where you would load into kayaks or the dib. There's a dib right there. Nice little area crew can go. Um, and then, yeah, we set out, I forget what this, it's called a swim step, I think, to load onto the dib or the kayak. That's what the dib looks like when it's moving. This is the um, front of the boat, everybody out on the nice deck. And then this is the upper deck, have really nice seating, tables and chairs. One of my favorite spots on the boat. This is our bartender, Kara, and so we get little bergy bits, small icebergs, and make drinks with them. This is the lounge, so this is an area that I spend a lot of time in, guests also. Bar is right there. I get presentations. Oh yeah, and this is a little concert. So that was just a really quick tour. I didn't really formally take those shots thinking I would create this video, but you'll probably get a better video when I'm on the Baranoff Dream because that will be my ship that I'll be on the whole season and I'll be able to give you a full tour. But I just thought I would shoot this out your way. This is kind of the vessels that I've been working on. I'm currently on land 
but I was on the water for two weeks. So that's a kind of a long story that you maybe you'll hear bits and pieces of it as we go. Things are kind of crazy here if you haven't gotten that yet, but the ship is great. I had a great time and I hope you enjoyed this tour. I will see you next time. Bye.